Hey guys and welcome back to Battlefront Updates and another episode of Top 5 Plays, the series where I feature the best, funniest and weirdest clips in the community. Today we will be taking a look at the luckiest kills. It usually takes a while to collect good clips for these specific episodes like this one, but I think I've collected a couple of very lucky kills so let's jump straight into it. Starting off we have Messi Lang with a very lucky disruptor double kill. He scouts an enemy jumping into the final control point on turning point and decides to fire at him in the air for some reason and he doesn't actually hit an enemy with the disruptor rifle but he somehow triggers a proximity bomb that goes off and kills two enemies. I'm quite sure that was not his intention but a very lucky double kill nevertheless. Moving on we have Freeze who is trying to snipe an enemy on the Bionic Laboratories map and just as he is about to fire an enemy jump packs in right in front of him blocking the shot and giving him the free kill. This guy really tried to sacrifice himself for the Empire but unfortunately both him and his teammate died which was very unlucky or lucky depending on how you see it. At the number 3 spot we have a fairly similar kill from YTTR but instead of using the pulse cannon he actually gets a kill with the ion torpedo that is not something you see every day i wish i would have gotten that kill when i tried to get those annoying ion torpedo kills to unlock the ion disruptor it was a very lucky kill though as you really have to align the enemy in between the vehicle and yourself at the honorable number two spot we have governor son who is using the quite underrated homing shot just as the missile is about to hit the enemy he jump packs away dodging the hit but if you look carefully you will see that the lock on icon is actually still on the enemy and I think you know where this is going. The missile actually returns after doing a dramatic 180 turn and kills the enemy. He must have been very lucky that it dodged all the tall buildings and things that it could have potentially have hit on the way back. Finally at the number 1 spot we have a clip from Valton X which I would probably class as one of the luckiest clips I've seen. As you can see he is using the airspeeder and he is very far up into the skies at the point where it's impossible to see where he is actually shooting and somehow he manages to hit a freaking proximity bomb that yields him a double kill from that range. But although that alone is extremely lucky he is still not done yet. He actually hits another proximity bomb during the same strafe run and gets the third kill. That is by far the luckiest strafe run I've ever seen. I don't think I've ever hit a proximity bomb just once with a ship to be honest. But that brings today's clips to an end. As always a big thank you to Elgato for sponsoring the series. They are what keeps my streams and recordings coming. So make sure to check them out in the description below to support the channel. And don't forget to enter the September giveaway if you haven't already. As there's still two weeks to go until the next winner for the HD60 will be drawn. Thank you very much for watching and as always may the force be with you.